On three. One, two, three! <laughs> One more time. Bleeding. Bat suit. Seal. <laughs> Badmobile. It'll get me home. You got it. Come with me. I, I would. It's only a matter of time before they realize I'm gone. Right now, let's worry about keeping you alive. Stay with me. Batman? Batman! A guy walks into a doctor's office. A guy says, uh, Doc, I've got this thing with my hands. They won't stop shaking and it's, it's driving me mad. And the, uh, the doctor says, Have you been drinking a lot? And the guy says, No, not, uh, not really. I spill most of it. <laughs> oh, heard that one before, have you? Pretty sure from you. It never was quite so relevant before. I decided my bedside manners could use some adjustment. Admonishing you never seems to get us anywhere. Uh, try not to move until the painkillers settle in. That leg still needs to heal, as do the third, eighth, and tenth ribs. How did I get here? Uh, Miss Kyle, she managed to get you into the Batmobile. The car arrived here and... Uh, and I tended to you. It must be nice to be reminded that you have friends you can count on. And then there are friends who do things like this. He could have killed you. He nearly did. Alfred... John is just... He has trouble controlling his impulses, and sometimes he acts without thinking. Okay, maybe more than sometimes. I know you care for him, Bruce, but he's hurt people, a lot of people. And I... well, I'm sorry to say, but it's only gotten worse. Computer, bring up all live news feeds. Filter for the word Joker. Gotham is still picking up the pieces after a man calling himself Joker led an assault on the GCPD. There has been no confirmation whether Amanda Waller, director of the agency, is still alive. The pursuit led onto the sidewalk where frightened citizens don't recover. Officers chased the madman for hours after the attack, we know but that lost him in the chaos. Eleven people were seriously this injured. This incident has many wondering who is the Joker, where did he come from, and where will his reign of terror end? You told him being aware of his anger was the first step to overcoming it. Reports have confirmed eight casualties. But I'm afraid that awareness has only shown him a path to channel that anger. 
You helped make him, you know. Excuse me? This Joker? From the start, John has hung on your every word. Bend over backwards to please you. Your influence is everywhere in him. Even the part of you that is darkest. And now he is that. You're right. Maybe I just refuse to see it. I know, Bruce. <sighs> I'm sorry, I... Uh, I shouldn't have said all that to you, the, the shape you're in. I've had too much time to think while you've been recovering. Careful now. All the way up, Batman. It's time to meet your new partner. <laughs> Sorry, my what? Uh, uh, that was your cue, dear. Uh, did you not... I'm not ready! Tiffany. Yes. Is my partner. I was hesitant at first, but I just couldn't talk her out of it, Bruce. She has your drive, your passion. Just like when you became Batman. That's a difficult thing to say no to. After Lucius died, you mentioned that we should recruit. Well, now we have. At least hear her out. All right. I'm trusting you on this one. If you think something like this can work, then I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh, I'm not sure about this at all. But I wasn't sure about Batman either. I may have my doubts, but... You need the help right now, and I mean you to have it. You have to put a stop to him, Bruce. I know you will, but... Whatever feelings you may have had for John, don't let him use them against you. You can't allow him to cloud your judgment. You don't know John like I do. He still considers me his best friend. He wouldn't abuse that. He's a killer, Bruce. A maniac who kidnapped the head of the world's top intelligence agency. You can't go on blind hope that he will be the man you once knew. While you were out, I've kept abreast of the authorities' search for Joker and his associates. The agency searched the subway lair the Pact had been using. They found nothing and raised what was left to the ground. John has often mentioned he misses Arkham. Maybe he's hiding there. Uh, I thought of that. I'm afraid our own drone network has come up empty in a search of the asylum grounds and its catacombs. Uh, as for the GCPD, they've investigated John's other favorite haunt, the Stacked Deck. Interviews there yielded nothing useful other than the fact John and a few of his regulars he's recruited to his cause haven't frequented the establishment in over a week or so. Willie Deaver on the left, and that's Frank Dumfrey. Waller set up a stake out of the funhouse after her agent's bodies were found. She has people there around the clock. John's gone to ground and in none of the usual places that we know about. I'm done. My word. Well, you certainly look the part. Just wait till you see what it can do. Oh my god. Bruce, are you okay? Don't worry. It looks worse than it is. Yes, you get used to him lying like this, unfortunately. Is this... Is this what happens to you all the time? Not all the time. Just the bad days.
It's a long shot, but the water tower, where Joker set his ambush for the agency, it's still an active crime scene. With a little bit of luck, there may be something there I can use to track him. I'm coming with you. Chemical sniffers, advanced sensor suites, early warning defense nodes, all with sync capability directly to your cow. It scans and catalogs evidence in a nanosecond. Maybe even faster than the back computer. It's even got some defensive options. Non-lethal, of course. It sounds like a plan. I won't let you down. I won't let either of you down. Let's get to work. You'll need these. For the pain. You, uh, you're forgetting something. Nervous. Isn't everyone before their first crime scene? How do you... I mean... How do we do this? Take the lead. Wait, what? We're here to find something that gets us closer to finding Joker. Focus on that. Show me how it's done, Miss Fox. Okay, then. Watch and learn. Oh, God. That's not how it's supposed to sound. That needs some work. You'll get it. Batman. I didn't expect to see you here. <clears throat> We're here to help, Detective. My partner and I need to examine the area. We may find something that'll lead us to Joker's whereabouts. Your partner? We might not be able to give you a lot of time. With Waller kidnapped and me getting canned, no one's sure whose jurisdiction this crime scene falls under. The agencies or the GCPDs. So for now, let's go ahead and say it's yours, all right? My people are here to help however they can. Glad you're here, Jim. I'd heard that... Technically, I'm not here. Not in an official capacity, anyway. Working outside of the law. Let me know if you need any pointers. What should we be looking for? After the pack separated, Joker had to find somewhere else to hide. There could be clues here that tell us where that is. And where he may have taken Waller. So this partnership between you and Batman, when did that happen? It's new. Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stacked deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. My drone can analyze it. Just point, and I'll shoot. Hmm. Someone was thirsty. What do you think? Wanna run DNA? No. We already know who it belongs to. Huh. This car is hotwired. It's a mess. 
Well, you think a guy like him would have stolen a car before? He's unconventional. That's one way to put it. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since. I'll run a check on manufacturers in the area, see who's recently been dinged for safety regulations. This much data, we're gonna need something to narrow it down. Like a name. Kids are natural at this. What happened here? Joker hit Bane with his car. Eesh. He'll be out of insurance. Custom plates. Probably didn't get this done at the DMV. Lil Puddin? Must be his way of remembering his time with Harley. <sighs> I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene. Oh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys. You and I came to an agreement. We worked together to make Gotham safer. I lost my head the other day. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. I said and did some things I'm not proud of. You were just doing what you thought was right, Jim. There's nothing to apologize for. You're a good man for saying that. I've missed this too. Got something interesting. It's a faint signal. Bane's venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Looks like it was crushed. Is that a boot print? It's tungsten steel, though. Hard to break that just by stepping on it. Bane's a big boy. Remarkable craftsmanship. And... silver filigree. He's become quite the showman these days. John Doe doesn't seem particularly... crafty. Oh, maybe they had a shop class in Arkham. They don't. Agency pigs. <laughs> Here I thought that was our nickname. Hmm. Not sure Riddler would like the new decor. This Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, that he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. Festive, but not a lead. A maker's mark. WD. Willie Deaver. 
Joker's associate. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade, with a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. Has a drinking problem, apparently. Chemical plants? Huh. Let me cross-reference Willie Deaver's former employers with the paint used on Joker's car. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. We found him. Well, well, well. What's all this then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> you got it all wrong, Batty boy. I'm here on agency business. <sighs> For the love of God. That's right. I'm one of the good guys now. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly whites. In the name of the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, copper. You all take orders from me now. You're going back to jail, Harley. I don't care what deal you made with Waller. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn. Suppressing fire. from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for me. So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are due for a nice long talk. Poor guy's falling in with the wrong crowd. You know him better than anyone. Let's work together on this. Oh, now there's an idea. You can tee him up, and I'll knock his head off his shoulders with my government-issued hammer. We're taking him alive. That's so. Uh, off just got way less interesting. <laughs> and here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need to... uh, hey, you cops can't just shoot people like that. I'm off duty. Hello? What's a girl gotta do to get... Hack those collars in my sleep. Sending you off to Blackgate, where you belong. <laughs> oh, please! The agency isn't gonna let me sit in a cell. I'm an asset. I'm gonna get what I want, and there's not a damn thing you can do about it. You can't touch me, Bats. I'm the one in control here. You think you're in control? You'll live the rest of your life under the agency's thumb. No, that ain't how this works. I'm doing this thing on my terms. No one else's. Now tell that to Waller when she gets back in the office. Go find Joker before he carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. <laughs> Batman. Good hunting. Thank <laughs> you. 
Got a visual on Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Louder. So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. You nearly killed me when you blew up that roof. I'm sorry about that. I just got a little carried away. I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away. But get this. I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. The only enormity I'm seeing is your jail sentence. Waller needs to go to trial. Maybe spend the rest of her life in a cell, but not whatever this is. Do you know how long that would take? <laughs> You know, I... I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through! Everyone is disposable to her! Even her own agents! I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. I've made tough calls myself. I understand. What?! God, I cannot believe you'd buy any of her crap! Clearly, we need to keep moving along. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! I didn't kill him. Like I said, it was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems! You need a distraction. Will I get my confession? The way boss talked about you, I thought you'd be better. Isn't my way. Really? Today, this isn't your way? You just 
saying things, trying to trip me up. Just like Waller. She justifies her crimes, says they're for the greater good. Just like you. You both use that word, justice, as an excuse. So you can do whatever you want. I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch. I am justice. What I do keeps Gotham from becoming the swamp it once was. I've given everything to protect this city. Delusions of grandeur much? Yet another thing you have in common with Waller. Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> and she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I know it was wrong. Now. Oh God, are you kidding me? These are the people you want to protect. I should kill them both. Everyone here is guilty. <laughs> this, is a, this is a joke. Leave them out of this, Joker. This is about you and me. Tell that to your distraction over there. I used a drone, and these. There's your proof. You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead. Uh. Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. I got her! Oh, <laughs> 
idiot. I was so busy looking at you, admiring you, wanting to be like you, be loved by you. I lost myself, but not anymore. You too. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. It's what I do. I save people. It's a shame we couldn't have saved more. I've got a lot of unpleasant phone calls to make. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. 
I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. I know how you feel. Well, look at that. You and me on the same page for once. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. Whatever your reasons, you went too far. You escalated things on the bridge. You got people killed. And coming after me? What were you thinking? You sided with that maniac. What was I supposed to do? Give you a medal? You act so high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. You're so far up your own ass, you can't see the truth. You're as nuts as any of them. Avesta had you paid the minute she walked in your office. She started listing off your pals. All those friends of yours who went cuckoo. <laughs> Don't fool yourself, Waller. You are too. I know exactly what I am. I choose not to live in denial. We're done here. Signal the withdrawal. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. So, here we are once again. Gotham safe because of you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Just like old times, huh? Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. I'd like that. So would I. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger. Tiffany, we need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. Why didn't you talk to me sooner? I... I wanted to work with you, to be part of your mission. But you kept this from me. A murder. I know! I'm sorry. I knew this would ruin everything. You were right. Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. 
My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. I had to do something to take back control. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it. But I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list. Rather than us working together? If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. you you're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, and on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. So... Take a back seat from the operations. Put your feet up for a while. Keep us stocked with cucumber sandwiches and tea. And just stand idly by while your enemies rend you limb from limb. Do a little dusting while you bleed out on the Batcave floor. I don't think so. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore. At least not to me. Now everything has become so grey. Ray, talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Someone clearly challenged with a proven tendency to violence. I'll admit that wasn't our finest moment, but at the time it seemed like our best course of action. Precisely my point. Our best judgment is no longer good enough. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. How many whiskeys is that, Alfred? <laughs> Not nearly enough. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day. 
dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. You think I want that? We can fix the problem, Al, but not if we run from it. Unless we are the problem. Leaving this all behind might be the only solution. One thing is for certain, my tremors are gone. <laughs> well, that's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors, the fainting spells, all of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please, don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I've been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. We failed each other, Alfred. My obsession, my... Relentless effort to stop crime. I should have seen the harm it was causing you. A father takes care of his son, Bruce. Guides him through the world. Not the other way around. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. Alfred, wait. Would you stay if I promised things would be different? Is that a promise you can keep? Like you said, there are a lot of ways to help. I'm sure the city could use a man of my talent and resources. Are you sure about this? I'll do whatever it takes to keep our family together, Al. Even this. So please... Tell me you'll stay. Well, maybe just one more night. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble.
thunderbolt on the whole goddamn hurricane. Gotham's safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I weighed my options and what can I say? I don't like to lose. I won't let you down. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? We're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain. Visitor for John Doe. Bruce! 